Hey, what's going on guys? It's Brian with Superman's Comics in collaboration with comicbookinvest.com. And in this video, I'm gonna give you my weekly picks for new comics that are coming out Wednesday, April 3rd, 2019. We're in April already. This year's going by very fast. It's kind of a slow week for comics. There's not that much out there. That's just my opinion. Unless you're a Marvel fan and you're and you're ready for War of the Realms and you like a lot of covers. Pretty sure everyone who ever did a cover for Marvel did a cover for War of the Realms number one. They might have even invited some of their kids. They might have had a cookout and said, hey, while you guys are eating that juicy burger, why don't you do a cover for War of the Realms number one? You'll see. You'll see. I'll show you. I'll show you coming up in this video. But also, just to let you guys know, my wife. Yeah, she says I have too many comics. So I am selling some comics right now, not on eBay, not going on eBay. But if you go to simplemanscomics.com forward slash shop, I have a new comic book store up there. I'm not a diamond account holder. These are just comics that I've picked up over the years that I'm deciding to purge. So simplemanscomics.com forward slash shop. Or just go to simplemanscomics.com and click to buy comics up at the top menu. Enough of that. Let's show you my weekly picks and we'll head over to the computer. We kick this week off with the adventures of the Super Sons number nine. The boys must saddle up to survive a wild, wild world of the West with an unlikely guide and Jonah Hex. This is a great series, really fun read. Always enjoy picking this up. John Kent, Damian Wayne. Going to be sad to see this go after issue 12, but I'm going to pick this up this week. Green Lantern number six. In order for Hal Jordan to complete his initiation and join the Black Stars, he's got to kill Adam Strange. There's a regular cover by Liam Sharp. There's also a regular price of Lucio Perillo. I, probably against most everyone else, I actually like the regular cover more on this one, so that's the one I'll be picking up. Young Justice number three. In this issue, all the secrets of Robin, Superboy, Wonder Girl, Jenny Hex, Teen Lantern, Amethyst, and Impulse are all revealed. We're going to have a regular cover by Patrick Gleason and a regular price variant by Dan Mora. I like the Mora cover on this, so that's the one I'll be picking up. Red Sonya number three. Now this book actually has 12 covers for it, but I really like just the one. And that is the Tedesco Virgin variant. There is a Christian Ward variant for this book as well, which is pretty nice. But I like the Tedesco. That's why I have it in this video. Amber Blake, number one. She was the only child when she was recruited to the Cleveland Institute, which is a school for gifted children. Predators hide in the school's administration, abusing the children they're meant to protect. And on the verge of exposing them, Amber finds herself fleeing for her life from the very man who recruited her. There's a regular cover by Butch Geis. There's also an incentive variant by Catherine Nodet. Danger Girl, Dangerous Visions 3D. This is going to give us the first issue of J. Scott Campbell's Danger Girls. And it's presented in full 3D, as well as the original preview story. Die number five. This brings us to the end of the story arc. It's the conclusion to Fantasy Heartbreaker. There's going to be a regular cover by Stephanie Hans. There's also a regular price variant by David Mack. Section Zero number one. This is volume two of a mini series. And a team of fearless adventurers uncover the secrets behind UFOs, monsters, and lost civilizations. There's three covers for it. There's a regular cover. There's a regular price variant by Walt Simonson. There's also a regular price variant by Jerry Ordway. Walking Dead number 190. There's dark times ahead because if the Commonwealth can fall, what does that mean for the rest of the world? <laughs> Avengers No Road Home number 8. The weekly series continues as Team Hulk vs. Nyx, Queen of Night, and Team Herc vs. Oasis, Creature of Mystery. One adventure faces the supreme test, and one adventure is going to fail. There's a regular cover by Yasmin Putri. There's also a regular price connecting variant by Mateo Scalera. Captain America number nine. This contains the Captain of Nothing story arc with no costume, no shield, and trapped behind bars with a thousand villains and killers who'd like nothing more than to see him dead. Steve Rogers fights back and he can do it all day. We have a regular cover by Alex Ross. There's also a regular price Spider-Man villains variant by Pasquale Ferry. Conan the Barbarian number five. In this issue, the Crimson Witch's dark plans for King Conan become grimly clear. There's three different covers for it. There's a regular side ribbit cover. Regular price is Guardian variant by Butch Geis. 
and an incentive Gabriel Hernandez Walta variant. Cosmic Ghost Rider destroys Marvel history number two. Can Cosmic Ghost Rider take up the mantle when Spider-Man is no more? With great power, there must also come total irresponsibility. We have a regular cover by Gerardo Savino. There's also a regular cover by Marcos Martin. I love the Zafino cover on this. In fact, I'm going to make that my pick of the week. Deadpool number 11. Now, I haven't really been reading this title as much lately, but there's a regular cover by Scott Hepburn. And the reason I have this in this video is the regular price as Guardian variant by David Nakayama. Love that cover, so I'm going to be picking that up. Domino Hot Shots number two. Here we have six undercover, highly trained, armed to the teeth women who are hunting a device from space, but someone invited Deadpool. We have a regular R.B. Silva and Frank DeMarta cover. There's also a 1 in 25 incentive Kamome Shirama variant. Mortal Hulk number 16. Not much needs to be said about this title. Everyone's aware of it. It's super popular. This is the week it's going to have a 1 in 25 incentive variant. Also, there's going to be a second printing of this 1 in 25 incentive variant. But there's also a regular Alex Ross cover and a regular price Mike McCone as Guardian variant. Also be aware that second printing of Immortal Hulk number 14 will come out this week as well. Major X number one. Here we have a mysterious new player entering the Marvel Universe and the X-Men are in his crosshairs. What is his mission and how can Cable hope to stop him? We have two different covers for this. It's a regular Robert Liefeld cover. There's also a 1 in 25 incentive variant. Marvel team up number one. That's right. Marvel's bringing back the team up series. This one teams up Spider-Man and Miss Marvel after a science demonstration at Empire State University goes bad. We have three different covers for it. There's a regular Stefano Caselli cover, a 1 in 25 incentive variant by Todd Nock, and a 1 in 50 incentive variant by Paco Medina. War of the Realms number one. This is Marvel's next big epic event. All ten realms have fallen to Malekith and his army except for one, and that's Midgard. Home to Thor's beloved humans, home to heroes and gods alike, now, at last, it burns. All hell breaks loose in New York City as Malekith and his allies begin their invasion, and the greatest heroes of the Marvel Universe watch as Earth falls. This is going to have a bunch of different covers. There's actually like 27 covers. I'm not going to mention them all. I'm going to show you everything I have the artwork for, and let you enjoy some tunes while it shows. Age Boogie number one. This is from Ahoy Comics, and it's the type of comic you get when you combine the 70s genres of apes, monsters, kung fu, sword and sorcery, and cosmic adventure. Lady Death Apocalyptic Abyss number two. This is gonna have five different covers for it. There's a regular Mike Chrome cover, regular price Billy Tucci Violet variant, an incentive Paul Green Premium Foil variant, an incentive Richard Ortiz Naughty variant. And an incentive Mike DeBalfo variant. I'm picking up the Paul Green foil variant. One of my favorite artists. Collect a lot of his covers. So that's the one I'll be picking up. So those are my picks for new comics that are coming out Wednesday. 
April 3rd, 2019. As always, comment down below. Let me know books you guys are picking up. Click that thumbs up button for me. And if you haven't already done so, please consider subscribing. I do a lot of comic and pop culture related videos on this channel. And that way, you'll never miss out on a single one. This is Brian with Superman's Comics in collaboration with comicbookinvest.com. I'll see you guys next week.